right. Uh, India Today has, uh, in fact, access exclusive visuals outside the house where Maulana Saad could be hiding. These visuals are from Delhi's Zakir Nagar area. The enforcement directorate has already registered a case, money laundering case against Tablighi Jama Chief Maulana Saad and eight of his associates. Now, enforcement directorate is also probing the Hawala channels which were used to rope in funds for the Tablighi Jamaat. Going across to my colleague Munish Pandey, who is joining us with more details on this story. Munish, uh, you know, these visuals that we have access, his quarantine period is over, uh, Maulana Saad. Uh, what is the Delhi police and the agencies waiting for? If they have registered an FIR, why is he not being questioned? Javel Ankit, at this point of time, we have been given to understand is that the Delhi crime branch wants uh, um, uh, Maulana Saad to appear before them so that they can question him in regards to the funding of uh, his organization, that is Makas. Apart from that, the Enforcement Directorate has registered a money laundering case against Maulana Saad. The case was registered yesterday and uh, I met few senior officials of Enforcement Directorate today and what they are claiming that uh, as of now, they are going through the documents and the main suspicion is that there were Hawala channels which were used by Marcus to receive funds from Middle East, uh, Middle East countries. And also they are looking into the funding of uh, his organization Marcus because there are many foreigners who have contributed to his organization. So as far as the money laundering concerned, enforcement directorate has started probing into it. The income tax department has already started looking into the tax evasion by Marcus. But as far as where he is and where he is riding, remember, his quarantine period is over, but he has not appeared before the agency. So the only option this time is that to start a search operation and then arrest Maulana Saad. But as of now, you remember there are many places where the people are still in quarantine. Okay. The initial team of Delhi police which went to Marcus, they are now in quarantine. So they have to take all the precautions and then only they can arrest Maulana Saad. At this point of time, they are hoping that Maulana Saad will appear before the agency for questioning. Back to you. Munish, uh, also if you could give us more details about the location where the Delhi police believes that he's hiding. Initially, it was said that he caught, uh, possibly could be in the Zakir Nagar area. These visuals are also from the Zakir Nagar uh, same area. Uh, uh, you know, is the, does the police exactly know where he is? Yeah, Ankit, he is in Zakir Nagar, that is for sure, according to the Delhi crime branch. Now, what they are saying that when he was in quarantine period, then he was uh, at some other place in Zakir Nagar, but after his quarantine period is over, he has shifted his base to a relative's place in Zakir Nagar. But uh, there are teams who are looking for the, uh, uh, Maulana Saad, and according to them, he is still in Zakir Nagar, but uh, as of now, they have not gone ahead with uh, searching a residence or, uh, you know, raiding a place where, Zaki, uh, where Maulana Saad could be. So, um, uh, because there is already coronavirus care in that locality, there are many people who are still in quarantine. They are hoping that uh, um, uh, after getting the human intelligence, they might go ahead with uh, a search of a property and then uh, Maulana Saad could be arrested. Thank you. Also, you know, before I let you go, uh, Munish, just uh, once again, uh, tell our viewers what are the allegations against Maulana Saad? Their FIR, under what sections has those FIRs been registered against him? And now, what is the angle that the ED is probing against Maulana Saad? Well, Ankit, for the benefit of our viewers, uh, remember there are two cases against Maulana Saad. One is by the crime branch, and according to the FIR which has been launched by the Delhi Police's crime branch, he has been booked for the offences uh, like culpable homicide not amounting to murder, also uh, for not um, uh, adhering to the guidelines given by the government of India as far as lockdown was concerned. Now, this case has been registered by the Delhi Police uh, crime branch. Now, apart from that, there is one case which has been registered by the Enforcement Directorate. Now, ED is the financial probe agency. They have registered a money laundering case. And why this has become very important? Because ED will be probing the entire funding of Marcus from where the money came from, the Middle East uh, connection of Marcus, the Hawala operators, or the 
these angles will be probed by the enforcement okay. directly. So as far as um, um, Marcus and Maulana Saad is concerned, there are two FIRs in this case and income tax department has already started looking into the entire funding. Okay. All right, thank you for joining us with all those uh, details, Munish uh, Pandey. We'll keep coming back to you on this very story. Meanwhile, hello everyone. This is Rahul Kamal here. Hope you enjoyed this video. For the latest news and analysis, like and subscribe the India Today YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to stay updated.